Hello everyone, hope you all are doing great. I am your host Vivek Chaudhary and the original video credited goes to 4JET Group and Coherent Incorporated. In this video, we are going to talk about the glass cutting process by a laser beam. When it comes to cutting glass, there are varieties of ways to make it happen. Despite the existence of similar methods of cutting glass like using a glass cutter or a bottle clamp. Cutting glass using conventional method works but complex shapes often can't reliably be cut without significant time, efforts and wasted material. But in laser cutting, glass can be done as easy as cutting plastic and cost significantly more limiting consumer level access. For cutting glass, soda lime float glass is the easiest and most straightforward to cut. So here is a question that how thick we can cut a glass. In terms of thickness, the thicker a material is, the harder it will to be cut. There may need to be multiple passes or even a focus adjustment of laser after a cut in order to get the laser to cut entirely through a thicker material. Now, how a laser can cut the glass or what is the process behind the glass cutting by a laser beam? In general, the most common wavelength to cut glass is 10,600 nanometer or infrared light from a CO2 laser. At this wavelength, the silicon and oxygen bond in most of the forms of glass absorb around 80% of the light. Thus, giving that wavelength a strong ability to cut the glass. Another commonly used wavelength effective for similar reasons is 355 nanometer which is lie in the ultraviolet zone. If we talk about the applications of the glass cutting lasers, we use these machines for display applications, cutting of coated, uncoated and stacked display components for uh, display and touch components of cell phone, tablets, wearables, etc. Waveguides for AR devices like holographic display, smart glasses, and heads up display. OLED devices such as mobiles, phones, monitors, laptop, lightning element, etc. And uh, we also use these uh, lasers for electronic devices, dicing and drilling of pale and pre processed wafers for pressure sensors cutting and pre-cutting of predetermined breaking lines on the substrate for microscopic slides and cover slips or cover glasses, customized diagnostic slides, flow cells for next generation sequencing and also we use these for optical devices, simulation of lenses for optical devices like micro electromechanical systems, camera covers, micro lens, array systems for lightning devices and so on. Now what are the advantages of glass cutting by a laser beam? It gives us superior surface and edge quality, ultra short pulse lasers guarantee minimum heat affected zones and therefore minimize defect initiation. By the help of laser beam, we can cut internal counters and holes. Using laser processing, the production of internal counters and holes are easily achieved. It also provides us free form capability. Laser processing leaves nothing to be desired regarding counters that can be cut out of brittle materials. And lasers are suitable for coated substrates and stack materials. Since laser can be adjusted to highly selective coated surface, so called sandwich substrate or stacks are easy to be processed. So friends, this is a very quick and short introduction about glass cutting by lasers i hope you are going to like and share this video because we are going to provide you all the futuristic technological updates on the very first also follow me on instagram complete contact information you will get in the video description box so thank you once again friends for watching us see you soon in our next video till then bye bye take care signing off vivek chaudhary thank you